Hey, good day, Kaiju fans. It is Thomas here. Today we have a quick review, and this time it is the Godzilla Museum Attack Theater by Mondo. So let's get started. The sun is really bright, so I'm doing a salute to all my watchers out there. Here's the other box. Now, I've heard some complaints about some of the paint being not done that well, so I am very curious myself if that's the case. But I believe Mondo will send you a replacement if, if it's a big problem. The front of the box says Godzilla Museum Attack Peter Artist Series 2021. And this also is in a clamshell type package packaging. All right, first look. And it appears to be pretty nicely done. I don't have the problem of horrible paint. Great. Let's get a closer look at this guy. And as you can see here in the daylight, the paint application and detail are very good. He also comes with a base and his name plaque. So far from the front and now the back, I don't see any obvious issues or defects. Now this Attack Peter is a statue with no articulation. Fortunately, his pose is fairly dynamic, so I'll definitely take that. And this base is the same as the previous ones from the Hanna-Barbera and the 54. Now, I'm not sure what was the inspiration of this particular Godzilla, but it does remind me of something from possibly the Aztec civilization or from long ago. Imagine if Attack Peter was their deity. That would be pretty interesting. Nevertheless, he's pretty neat and I'm glad that I picked one up. He also has a very cool profile and reminds me of the 65 Godzilla. Now in just a moment, I'm going to grab a few figures for comparisons and wrap up this review. For comparison number one, we have the X plus 25 centimeter 1954 Godzilla and he's still taller than the attack Peter even on his base. For comparison number two, we have yet another X plus 25 centimeter figure, and this time it's the classic 1974 Mecha Godzilla, and definitely a fan favorite film. And finally, for comparison number three, we have the adorable Marmot Para Baby Red King, and that's a lineup that I definitely like. So in closing, on this Attack Peter by Mondo is that I think he is a pretty rad looking figure and an interesting conversation piece. Also, just by his unique appearance makes him a cool pickup and a stand out on your shelf. So far, I'm quite pleased by my two Mondo Godzilla statues. Will I pick up the 54 as well to complete the trio? I'm certainly considering it. Join us at Kaiju Collectors on Facebook and Monsters with Attitude on YouTube for more Kaiju content. Please like and subscribe and thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more and I'll catch you next time. Bye bye.